Yes, welcome to the World Cup show with not one fucking player that are playing the World Cup. Oh, should have met. He deserved to. It would be a bit of you. Let, us, let the country down a lot of times, I need to say. <laughs> All right. The here. He's going to get us there this time. That's a bit harsh. He's just had a big operation. <laughs> <laughs> but he's on this show, so. I'm budging. Like, take the four hang away, mate. On you go. <laughs> You're just talking the whole show. Just doing any, any, any pints, mate. <laughs> <laughs> right, our World Cup preview comes to you from the office of multi award winning law firm and Paul Slane's dad's lawyers <laughs> and Uncle Broomhill legal partners, Jones Way! <laughs> what a team. Take it away, Kevin Kyle. Right. Operating fight the UK. Well, you know <laughs> Jones White are a multi multi service law firm with experts in personal injury and medical negligence claims, family law, dispute resolution, conveyancing immigration, wills and estates. Take that gun away from his head. <laughs> right, Paddy, <laughs> Bud Light. I'm not doing no, that. He's not doing that. Whatever life throws at you, their team of experts have the experience <clears throat> and knowledge to give you the help, support and guidance you need, Simon. Just head over to joneswhite.co.uk or follow the link in the description below to find out more on how they can offer you support any legal matter you may be facing. Hey, hey, Steph, you're getting divorced, legal and white will be in touch. <laughs> 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 Sorry, we'll be in touch. What about would you use this if it was you and Lynn? Oh, so, that's that. on the cards. I think She's I would, uh, me. <laughs> I think I would need a few of the um, personal injury first and foremost, medical negligence, family law. I'm going to have to use them for a Imagine event. your life if you and Lynn split. Oh, mate, you'd sleep in that taxi, wouldn't you? Mate, I you'd get a shower my, put in the back oh, of the taxi. My, 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 my life overload, would crumble <laughs> before <laughs> me. Crumbs overload. <laughs> <laughs> Do you know what she did last night? She pulled out a free Bentos pie for tea. Aye. Oh, she hates you, mate. Free Bentos That's curry pie. Up. I've never heard the likes How ever. Was it? It was fucking dynamite. Uh, it nice? I swear to God. Is it not like plastic steak? No, I don't know. It was, it was curry, free bintos curry pie. Amazing. Why is it? Fucking what hell. do you mean on the side of that? Uh, yeah, and chicken rice soup. You had steak <laughs> pie and soup? <laughs> what, steak <laughs> pie in the soup? Chicken, chicken, rice, rice, chicken <laughs> rice soup first. You just put it on the Chicken <laughs> rice soup first, then I had the curry pie afterwards. Oh, the curry pie? <laughs> <laughs> Your dad uses Jones and Rachel. <laughs> oh, it'd be my eye. He burned it a few times, I imagine. So they were getting pelted this morning because I said about the one he went into this first, didn't he? His dad, his dad did genuinely phone him this morning. His dad phoned him this morning going mental because obviously on the podcast I said that he tried to get into the butter restaurant because the Swiss woman team had won the tennis, Billie Jean King Cup. Aye. They all went into party, so my dad tried to get in after him. Jen, Jen's story, but then the, the work he's a day have been shouting at him about that, so... Need to be careful what I'm saying. Me sure. Sure. Yeah. Stop it's coming home. <laughs> home. It's coming home. I'm worried about England. That's what he sings no. when he's got a bird in it, George. No, no, don't do that again. <laughs> Point at that. You're not singing it. Don't, don't, do, don't, don't do that, that again. Don't do that again. No, you hate it, you hate it didn't you? You don't like that? But you still take it, but you'll go and do the English media and take it away. All right, okay. Don't do it again. I would agree with you. He's patriotic, isn't you? Come on. It's going to, we're going to get enough of that over the next couple so. of weeks. I know, but they've got no chance of winning no, it, which I, I disagree. That means I think they've got a I chance. I disagree. I think they've got a chance now. We're looking at the, they can get a great <laughs> Look run. at your face now. Mate, they can get a great <laughs> run. <laughs> <laughs> they've got a chance. They've got a chance. They've always got a chance. They can get a great run. Did a little fat Mortal Harren was saying that they had a hard quarterfinal? But see, looking at the, the run they've got, it could be similar to the last World Cup where they go to the semi final. Nah, I'm not having it. I think because of the expectations, no high. They might. They might. Enjoy We've had a negative run of having results, haven't they? Pressure. Coffee's in. Mm -hmm. There's a the coffee's in. We've had a. Where, where's the World Cup being held? Qatar. What's your point? Huh? <laughs> <laughs> I know. So I... he's came up with something genius this morning. Well, what, is, everybody knew, right? Everybody knew the last two weeks has gone mental about this World Cup, saying it shouldn't be happening. This World Cup was decided <laughs> 12 years ago. So we've had 12 years to do something about it. Now we want to wait All right. until now, a week before the World Cup. And let's go and ask all the players, is it right for you to go? Is it right for the manager to go? Why don't you let them do their job and play football? That's what they're, they've done. They're representing their country. If the World Cup, by the way, it shouldn't have happened, but 12 years ago it shouldn't have happened, the same things were happening then. So to now put that on the player side is, is totally unfair. Mm. Journalists and all that want to pipe up and say this about the managers. As a journalist, did they write any articles and, and uh, hammer home that this World Cup shouldn't be on? No, they didn't, but they want to wait a week out. We know it's going to happen now, so it's pointless saying it. So let the players go and play football and let the manage. And let's enjoy the World Cup now for football reasons. That other side of stuff. Good point, Paul. Do you know, do you know what I mean? Jürgen said that word for word this morning. Aye. That's it. Just done. leave now. Just that's as funny. No, but we, we need to enjoy it because everybody keeps saying, I'm not looking forward to it or it's no right. And listen, it's not, it's not affecting you. We know the things on the right, but it should have been dealt with years ago in the making. So let's enjoy it. It's a World Cup. It's one yeah, of the best I'd things in the, the world. Die. I think with the players, the, in general, if players get involved in politics, they get told to keep their nose out and stick to football until it suits until they get other people's agenda. Yeah. And then they're forced into. Who'd you vote? SMP? Pushing a, a message. 
<laughs> no, I, I don't. I don't get involved in in all that, and I don't think players. The, as you said, the the pressure shouldn't be on players to come out and no. speak out about it. Of course, they're going to be asked, and I think they should give their opinion on it. And I don't think they should be hammered either way, whatever they say. Yep. But I think players are wheeled out too often now to yeah. say, "Go on, you front, and you say it because of your influence," and they're, they're obviously almost like puppets. And you're right; it should never. The World Cup should never be in Qatar. No, it, it should, should never be in Russia before either. Should it should be no, Qatar, Stunner. Better, 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 uh, better in Stunner than Qatar, I think. Are you raging with it, I'm not raging with it because the world and politics and how things work, strange decisions are made all the time. How these decisions are made, we all know how they're made. People, have, have, people pockets have to be lined somehow. Um, You're just is there, there, is there one of the lawyers in? <laughs> <laughs> big, John, big, John Pre- <laughs> big John Prescott there. Uh, I just, so, but it is, it's happening now. Rick Slaney says 12 years ago when it was announced, we had an opportunity then to, to sort it out and it could have been done. But we're now two weeks, well, we're now coming up to a week away from it. It's going to happen. We can't get into about it, so we've just got to enjoy it. As best we can. Well, we Talking about politics, that was funny when you dressed up as Nicola Sturgeon on that show. Oh my God, do you remember that? I dressed up as Nicola Sturgeon, mate. Came out <laughs> not one of the fans knew who I was. It was nearly as bad as the brown suit. What so did didn't it? <laughs> so oh, right. How am I still on this show? <laughs> How many nightmares I've had? I'm going to say a good point now, I don't know. About have it. you forgiven Tom Boyd the last World Cup? No, <laughs> he kicked off his face. Can you remember? <laughs> so he did, he did, didn't he? Aye. Can you remember when he's worked for that World Cup? Boy, ninety eight. I watched Aye. it. We, we went out in the street and played football and never watched it. Yep. Do you know me? No. We what I remember we all came down. We, me and my brother get sent to McDonald's. Came down with about ten meals <clears> and we all watched it in the house. We was it what an ex- what a feeling? Some smell in that oh, house. <laughs> stinking. <laughs> Absolutely, it actually helped the smell. <laughs> <laughs> in fact, what, you were obviously slight, just slightly older. Mate. How Aye. was it? Where did you watch I, it? I don't remember where I watched it. I just remember. Watching it, Scotland obviously first game against Brazil, and you're thinking we've got a chance here of winning this game mm. against that that team, Brazil team with all the top players. And then usual, we go and we don't manage to hold on to the result. And that's no saying, oh, that was poor show because Brazil was mm. top drawer. But I think the Morocco game was it. Mm-hmm. Had you was Nor- a joke. Norway and Morocco was the other was the other two teams. You yeah. think mm, after the performance, we've got a great chance of getting out the group. You know Switzerland, they might be wrong here. Is that's it a Euro? Euro oh, is that Euro? Euro is that Euro? Fuck. Well, good, but you've been out for it. You went for it. You didn't work. Colin scored the penalty, didn't he? He's doing that. He's six pack six. He's got an eight pack, mate. We were ten pack, but where did you watch it? Eating a free bent or spider? No, I was in the I was in the in the in a. Bar, I think it was a bar pause there, a big screen watching it. Cause what age are you? Uh, 17. In 90, were you? 98. Are you talking about 98? Oh, oh, yeah. By the way, that table tennis is high. absolutely oh, right. Right. Oh, right. Oh, right. So I, I was um, mm. the, the reason we were a bit in Shana were big on it because Colin Calder would play and he was from oh, Shana. So we were obviously rooting for him and that, like Ronaldo up against a boy for Shana. You, you said that as a, like, were you not rooting for any of the other Scotland players? Just, no. just one. <laughs> Did you have a hang up with him, Mr. Now, like a big poster or anything? Uh, poster no, naked, just, you said. Uh, <laughs> no, I just, just respect that he, he was able to get to that level and have the opportunity to, to, to play for your country at a World Cup. You know what I mean? That's the last, that's the, the last group the that we've had. You know what I mean? The World Cup must be the best field ever. Even the yeah. opening ceremony when oh, they come right. out with their kilts and all that one. Absolutely brilliant. Brilliant, brilliant. Yeah. yeah. Really good. Wonder if we didn't have the team this year, we would have went out and go. If Scotland went? No, see if they'd any, but like, I was thinking about it the other day. See, the new, the position we're in, like talk sport not again. I know England's in it, but it would have been brilliant if you could have After that rare. last Monday, I think us three would have won. <laughs> <laughs> you're not allowed in, Qatar, now you've they, just said they should not they, be there. They, they shouldn't be there. <laughs> <laughs> I had to book the flight fees with them. <laughs> <laughs> ah, right, plenty of drama before it starts. Ronaldo, the <clears> absolute <throat> fruitcake. Did you see him and Bruno Fernandes with a cold aye. reception? Aye. Aye. For Fernandes, I love it for well, him. Well, Cancelo's done it as well. Did you not see the uh, video on the training ground? Aye, but. That that looks like something know. different, doesn't it? Yeah, that, looks, aye, that looks like something like he's happy with, 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 with something else in that training situation, and Ronaldo's just went over aye. to consel, console him. Consuelo, Consuelo. Thanks, a disgrace for Ronaldo. Console, Consuelo. Consuelo, Consuelo. Consuelo, Consuelo. Consuelo, Consuelo, and he's not interested. But would you want to get that as your team, mate? Well, that's what I'm saying, and I think it's. Me uh, uh, Pundits uh, spoke about this yet. I think Mark Lawrence has. <laughs> 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 but Navy's touched upon we've all said about shocking about Man U they're going into the, the World Cup a week away and he's bringing all this onto the Portugal team all the press now are going to be hounding right, that, that thing 
and these players now need to deal with all that and that's all about Ronaldo I, I think it's so sh- it's always I think one of the players came out yesterday and says it's always about Ronaldo regardless of what the story is it's always about him so I, I mean the timing isn't great for him going to a World Cup because you're right the focus then with all the players is like if, if he's if he's approachable, I don't know how he gets on with the rest of the squad, but you'd be asking him, what yeah. do you do that for? What were you thinking? Right, so see, me. that was you, Faddy, and you had like, an international, <clears throat> international team that was at a different club and he'd done that interview the day before you met up. Would you say it him when you got there? What were you thinking? I would just say, aye, what's going on? Would you? Aye. Why no wait to find out, wouldn't you? Mm. Yeah, well, he's letting everybody know that he's available mm. so he can go and he'll be hoping to have a good World Cup. Uh, if it was a, one of my teammates... Would you be angry with him? No. Because no, it had nothing to do with you? No, it's nothing. Uh-huh. Nothing to do with me. I mean, and he is the star of the team. Even though he's he's older and maybe not at the levels, he's still the, he's still the talisman for Portugal. Um, so no, I think you'd just be like, interested more than, than angry with him because, let's be honest, I know it, you have your opinion on it. It's Ronaldo, he, can, he does what he wants. Mm-hmm. Nobody's going to tell him. You see him, you know, Gary Neville and, and Wayne Rooney having a go at him. That's the care, doesn't Rooney's it? got a bit of cheek to the left of it. He done it, man. You mm-hmm. remember? Well, came out, remember he came out in the press and slaughtered all the team. Remember that the front papers? Do you yeah, remember that? Yeah, I think he just said he's not good enough. He, he just mm. he just said it's maybe best that he goes. He's no he's no as good as what he was. I don't think there was anything like to stir up any animosity between the two of them. I think he was just asked his opinion on it, and he says, "Aye, aye." He's, Why he's does he not the level. Care about what people are saying about him? He's run out. He's won mm-hmm. everything because he's no he. He knows, you know yourself when you're getting a bit older and you can't do what you used to do. You you start to think, right? Does everybody else notice it as much as me? Mm-hmm. And now Deflective. people have you think you turned on him. Paranoid at that that age, like because not only paranoid because he's not to be paranoid about. But I'm thinking to like later in my career, I worried a wee bit more about because I was getting older. Aye. Worrying what about the young. Me? What about the people thought about me? Because. <clears throat> when you're in a young, when you're younger and you're in your team and you're flying your day and everybody respects you and you think and then when you get older and players come in that you don't know they're looking at you maybe remembering you from your good times yeah. and then all of a sudden you're not performing to that level they're like well he's not as good as what we thought he was and mm. you start to think oh god and maybe maybe it's a case of that but ultimately Ronaldo is um, an icon of, of world football He's got to keep that in house because you get millions of kids looking at him and future young generations looking at him. Is that what they're going to do now? Because the, everyone's learned and copied and things like that. Is that something that players are going to stop doing now? Out and managers and saying, look, we all are disappointed with managers at some point in my career and we all have an opinion, but just chat with Doan and have it out with him. Mm. You'd like to think that managers nowadays, you, you're one, somebody came to Doan had a bit of beef. You'd like to think you'd have a bit of debate and come to a resolution. Don't say out about the beef. <laughs> <laughs> it's no breeze. It's no breeze. <laughs> but what my point is, you, you, you would like to think you'd have a bit of debate and have a resolution somehow. Well, he came out and said he wants the Portugal manager sacked, didn't he? He wants Piers Morgan to be there. Like. <laughs> 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 I think it's hard. Sure. It's hard because he's, he's obviously, he's went to Man United to try and get them back to where he thinks they should be. And, I mean, coming out and saying that the gym's no changed and, and the place is the exact same as when he left. I think they are, I think they are things that you could be, you could come out and say. Although you look at him and he's maybe no got that electric pace. He's no slow, and he's maybe look. This interview's coming out. It's maybe one where he's got a like you with that table tennis, something's in his head, mm-hmm. uh, that he's maybe trying to do too much. You see him, he's, he's desperate to get his shots away and I, th- I think he could still perform at a top level. It's just everything's kind of turned sour. He scored 18 goals last year mm. for Man United in a, in a team that struggled. Um, I think the top scorer in the league was 23 goals, so he's no, like, totally gone. Mm. He's obviously struggled this year, but there's been a lot, you never get a full pre-season um, and since he's come back for that it's always been you know a story every week if he's on the bench the story is Ronaldo it's, mm-hmm. it's always been it seems to be maybe maybe a distraction I think Ten Hag will be delighted because it yeah, seems nah. like it's a massive distraction for him and yeah. that's it gone he just says look he doesn't come back 
we, we come to an agreement and, and we can move on. He can move on with building his team. Ronaldo can go and he'll probably get a good move and he'll probably go and score goals again because he's in incredible shape. Yeah. <coughs> Used to the same world class striker still? No, I would agree because he it, although, although he lo maybe lost a, a bit of pace, whatever, he's not going to lose what he thinks upstairs. Can you press that with Ronaldo in your team? Depends how, how many players? Depends how, depends how Portugal set up. Mm. If they start with pressing, listen, Ronaldo's fit enough to press. You can press with him in your team. If Ronaldo's, Ronaldo's fit enough to press, mm. If it, that's how they're going to line up, he's going to have to either accept that or sit in the bounds. The manager's got to be strong. Watching the documentary last night on Ronaldo, the old Ronaldo R9, he went into Milan with that, um, the Argentina manager, Quinn, just didn't play him. Yeah, I've seen that. And that's what happens. He stuck by his guns and it ultimately it failed for the, for the, for the manager. Mm. It's the same with this Ronaldo. He's, he'll still, Portugal will still create chances of Ronaldo. Will still Portugal be in the manager book. can't. Bench him. No, no he'll be. Uh, I think Ronaldo will not do that to him. No. Remember, the, remember the Euros Portugal won. Ronaldo yeah. was at, came off injured and was actually the manager. Managed yeah. on his side. Mate, the manager's not got a say, is he? Is he still the same team. guy? Aye, still him. Is it still the same guy? Still him. And the, the worry about Ronaldo is up front. They didn't win their group. Serbia beat them at the group. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? So if they're not beating Serbia, they win that group then. And they've got a good team as well, didn't they? Brilliant team. World class team. So many players you, I mean, you want me to list if you're on Kinsella, Kinsella, Ruben Diaz. Bernardo Silva, Jal Felix, Bruno Fernandez. Bruno Fernandez. The boy, I mean, there's a, an absolute superstar. It might be the boy Leal at AC Milan. Aye. Wait to see him. He plays it on the left. I think you could go up front with him. Aye. He's got every attribute to be a good striker. So they've got top players there. Does Ronaldo get in the way of them? I think so. Mm. I think that when you watch him for Man United, I don't think they look the same team. I don't think players even. Depends how they play. Aren't players it? look nervy when they're playing on Is the this Ronaldo's they play uh, like last, LB's last World Cup? Is this his kind of swan song internationally? Does he get a band? Do you I think, don't so? think so? I think, you think he'll, he'll just keep he'll playing. on records. He'll just, just keep pointing to score goals Aye. and beat every, every, every record, record extend. Record appeals, just things like that. Yep. And he'll just keep going. You could, like, he's come out with this. If, if it was a guy that was that was thinking about Jack Nan at any level, yep. that interview would come out. This is the problem. I'm going to the World Cup. I'm going to enjoy it. And then I'm off. That's yep. me done. But he's coming out to to fight back almost and stick up for himself because I think he's maybe been forced into by by himself when the transfer window was open and all the talk was Ronaldo is he going to leave all the all the nonsense at pre-season he, he put out a, a tweet or he put on Instagram uh, I, I will have my time to speak the truth will come out in That's a couple of weeks everybody will know and, and he never so then people are saying right where is it? Mm. So he's probably thought, waited for this moment. Aye. Yeah. I'm, I'm coming out. I'm going to say it. I'm going to go to the World Cup. I'm going to show everybody on the biggest stage that I can still play. And he's going to go and pick, uh, you know, what team he goes to. But whether it works out like that, I'm imagine not sure. what kind of guy he'll be if he wins the World Cup. The worst ever. Oh, do you think God. he, um, do you think that he's planned the timing of this to now in his head psychologically think, mm. I'm going to go to this World Cup and I'm going to be a bit of the former me? And have the world talking about him again mm. in a different mm. way. Is it timing? Whereas it could ultimately be the greatest interview ever if he goes on and does. I don't know. Maybe Ali McCoy was pretty good, mate. What's that? Interview Ali McCoy. I think that'll be beautiful. Oh, right, 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 no, no, oh, yeah. Or it could totally backfire where he goes there and it become he's no <clears> and people then just kind of no disregard him because you can never disregard one of the best players we've ever witnessed, but the talk becomes a wee bit less. It's, 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 listen, we don't know. Well, here's one for you. What would you, what would you think Ronaldo would rather? Finish top goal scorer in Portugal, get put in the semi-final? That's a stupid question. I've, I've, no, as soon not. as I've asked I it. Like it. I know right, like or it. No, they, no, they, or win it. it and he doesn't score a goal. No, but you need, you need to win a World Cup. But I know you're saying the he's the type of person that would rather score goals. But cool. in this one, you would, because he would always say I've won a World Cup. Messi's mm. not. I mean, I see, you would, would like it, to think it, like it would be to win it. Is it eight goals? I think it top goal The most in one tournament. Uh, not sure, it? Is it eight? I think Ronaldo scored eight. <laughs> was it? I, I don't know. I think it was Ronaldo. I think he scored eight. Right, enough about him. He's going to get enough. There's going to be enough. I'm going to talk to him a wee bit. Favourite World Cup you've ever watched? I'll go 2002. Is that the one where Ronaldo ripped up? Korea and Japan. That was outstanding, that. Brazil were unbelievable. That was the one with Seaman, wasn't it? That was the one with Seaman. Seaman got it. By Ronaldinho. I actually remember World Cup 90. Aye, so there. Toto Scalacci for it. No, Did you have any boost when he done that celebration? Toto, Toto Scalacci, Gaza, Gaza was. That's on the new and all. There's is a few that, documentaries oh, about it. Oh, man, Gaza. Was Gaza, Gaza, was Gaza top oh, level? Aye. Yeah. aye. When, you see, when you see Ronaldo 2002 beating the players he did for that toe poke against Turkey. Mm. Aye. 
And then the, the quick feet Germany for the second one in the final yeah. slot and mm. stuff. That was what Gaza was like. Their situations stuck out in everybody's memories. Gaza was like that when he was dribbling past everybody with the elbows up high and then obviously the tears on the side with Lineker and stuff and um, Bobby Robson. That, and mm. like obviously uh, uh, like Toto Scalacci was the starter. Yeah. World but Cup. by the way, Spain, that Spain's the best team that's won the World Cup. Ah, they won the They were an absolute ah, match. Yeah. They won two penalty shootouts. 80 possession every they're game. They were amazing, but they won two penalty shootouts in that. It just shows you, didn't it? Because they are one of the, I think they are, that's probably that year is one of the best ever. Mm-hmm. Maybe well, Paul Zanfi that won two penalty shootouts. <laughs> maybe, maybe they didn't. Oh, maybe they did. Maybe they did. I think they did. I think they did. I think one of the Brazil teams, Portugal. Ronaldinho, Ronaldo. I think that was that South Korea team, on it? I lost. Uh, just for pure enjoyment <coughs> France team that won it in 98 as well brilliant team was it uh-huh. brilliant remember, was it remember the they striked Ronaldo the night before the hotel <laughs> well that's in that thing <laughs> no, no he took a seizure no, the took documentary fit. he took a seizure <laughs> the, 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 this is where we're having this in here because he's getting sued so is he <laughs> <laughs> it's, uh, it was a nervous breakdown right now he had I bet somebody no, said the chefs were at it. Mm-hmm. Seriously, yeah, it was I a free w- bento steak pie. <laughs> 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 no, the curry pie. The curry pie. That's not allowed to mention that. But supposedly the night before, because our hotel was quite creepy, it was out of the way. Brazil's just put them out of the way. Mm. And supposedly there's, there's CCTV that's never been released that they've seen 12 chefs wandering behind it. Uh-huh. 12? Se- <laughs> 12 chefs? Maybe 20 or something. But Here's a question for you, right? See if he's got this. Out that Brazil team, don't know you answer because you've watched it. Who do you think Ronaldo's teammate was? Uh, roommate? Carlos. Who do you think? Uh, I'd go Carlos. Uh, what's, how'd you know that? I think I've seen. Oh, have you seen it? Uh, you've seen it as well. I've I've bit, it, the best bit was when Ronaldinho caught him mm. and I said, I used to have a picture, picture of him at 13, 14 and cuddled him for the first time, kind of meeting him and that and said, like, You're my idol. Oh, I'm my idol. And uh, he says, you're, you're aging a bit now. It's me. I'm going to take over. Class. Brilliant. The shot he used to be a wee boy. We've had some World Cups. That one, 2002, that Brazil won. Were you there that trip? We were. We were. We obviously played in that stadium against South Korea, who went on no to the quarter final. Semis. Semis? Semis, I think. They were good, weren't they? Were they? they? Remember that the night we played? One, twos for fun. Yeah, yeah, was, we were thinking, like, look at the size of them in the, in the tunnel. They were all Did tiny. they not be early? Uh, I remember right, saying they be early, didn't they? Because the, 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 guy, the guy played uh, in the Italian league, put them out, and he got... Is that not right? Hu- Huang... Uh, <laughs> I'm not God, you're very brave no. to go have a go us. Oh, what's his name? But did they know... Were they not cheating everybody to South Korea? No, 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 they were just they were so small. It right? was, so was an Italian team, and they tell them don't come back. Come back, that's right. I ah, remember it. Is it Verona or something like that? I don't know. It might have been. Uh-huh. Was Jason Park? Jason Park. Number, Jason Park. He was number thirteen that night because I whole, came in with a strip. They, they amazing, I came with a strip number thirteen, and they were just. Oh, they were brilliant. Oh, they was it four one we got beat? Aye, I was. I never got on. I know, but you didn't beat us in four one. So you didn't make your debut that night then? No, South Africa. I got on for ten minutes for Dobbs. Uh, and I was thinking, fuck it, I've just become a Scotland international here in Busan. <laughs> I don't know. And then we played, who did we play after that? South Africa. South Africa. And Hong Kong. Hong Kong. So I, I never got on that game either. Did you know? I only got on one game. <laughs> Can I, you were the best player we had. <laughs> <laughs> who was it? We bet it. We bet it. I had two games. I That's why he's sitting in the house. Right, we're on to England. Semi finalists last time. Quite close, weren't they? Was it penalties again? Was that right in the middle of our. No, I think it went. Was it Croatia? Aye, Croatia. Extra time, Mark. Yeah, 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 right, right, scored. No, um, I know. Do you genuinely think they can go further than that? I think they could. I think they've got the players that defence is. I wouldn't say they worry because I'm. I'm not worried. But if you were looking at it from an England point of view, you would say defence, as you said, Aye. because you don't have a Harry Maguire's not played. He seems to be, you know, first choice for for Southgate. Um, Reese James is missing. I, I think Trippier. I think he's if Walker, Trippier, Walker's fit, then I'd play Walker. But Trippier's been excellent. Uh, Luke Shaw has started to play well, and I think they're strong. But they've got they've got. I think they've got problems because Raheem Sterling always seems to play for them. Yeah, but he's not in great form. No, but he, he sticks with him. Um, you've got Foden. Where do you play him? It's not the same as playing for Man City. Uh, Saka has been excellent for Arsenal as well. Yeah, it's, you know he's no renowned Southgate for being attacking, but when you look at the players, you want to go and try and get the best out of your players. And I think to go back to your point, because there's no any expectation, or no a great deal of expectation, they're not really having the manager. They had a terrible end to their Nations League. This is probably their best chance for me to go and do something. Bellingham's going to be a star this tournament. Nah, definitely, I think he'll Jay, be the standout. Bellingham. Does Rice play? I, I do. Like, I like him. And like 
we're talking about Harry Maguire and obviously the troubles that he's had. Mm. Could he come to the World Cup and have a great World Cup yeah, and get his player well again? again? Because Maguire ultimately, I don't think so. do you not think no. so? No. I think he's could. gone completely. Mate. Nah, but he's going to go to a manager that's saying to him, Boy, I don't care yep. mm. how you've played. You're in. You're, you're first choice for me. Go and play the way that you've been playing for England. I don't know. He maybe, he maybe go to a back three to help I, well, him, I think. Uh -huh. I don't think they get it right when they play a back three. Who yeah. is the back three? Maguire? Stone, he plays Walker, Stone, Walker, Walker. Side, doesn't he? Yeah. Yeah. See, I like Walker. Walker yeah. But the problem with Walker is he probably hasn't had enough game time to get to... He's had an operation. Uh, get to that level because how do you have an operation and then just let the odd bounce game here or there get to that level at a World Cup? But I would say if he was... 70 to 80%. I'm, I'm picking Kyle Walker. Ben White's good. The only yeah. thing with... Ben White is good. Ben White is good. I'm in a three. Uh -huh. And I would, I would play, play right back, isn't he? I'd play Ramsdale instead of Pickford. So would I. Ramsdale, yeah. You go Pickford? Aye, uh, because he's a toughie, isn't it? People look at Ever Ever Everton have, have been poor, but he's not. He's been brilliant mm -hmm. for Everton. Okay. He, he had a, one where he made a mistake at the weekend against Bournemouth, but he's been really top draw for I think Everton. I got Ramsdale's confidence just now. They're top of the league. Aye. He's a big yeah. party wire, no, isn't he? I think Pickford's yeah. been very good for England in the past. That England team that want one. to play it for the back. I think I Ramsdale's a goal if you want to play it for the back, you play him, but I don't know if Southgate does that, does he? I don't know. Pickford's got a strong left foot. Pickford's good. With Have you ever seen Pickford in real life with his left foot? Yeah, but he's, is he made a boomer at the night? Singing it a, well, it depends, it a bit. Well, it depends, doesn't it? But it, work, it can work either way. If you play it for the back, mm. great. If you're on a... The problem is with Pickford... Pick it like the way Ederson does for Man City picks up these long. They both are hacking the long. Pickford can do that, but you're hitting Harry Kane. Harry Kane's not going to run and be one on one with the keeper. Do you know what I mean? But England's got a world class strike, and Harry Kane is going to score goals. Huh? Harry Kane, so world class, but slow, very slow. And you mm. need people running about him to run half him and yep. create the space for him. Get and like he said, him. with Southgate being negative, is he going to allow players to get closer to Harry Kane to to have? Who are the players that running behind? Saka. Stella. Saka still and Foden Foden's, Foden's mere coming to feet, isn't he? No, but I think Foden's quicker than people think ah, he is. He is. Um, some of the moments in the years but with England's been massive, isn't it? Ah. The man Rooney, remember Rooney gets sent off? Ronaldo winked. More than Ronaldo, uh, Beckham, Beckham sent Simeone. Off. Beckham. Rooney got injured in the... I think she was a he was flying that one of yeah, uh, 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 Ronaldo Rooney. He was incredible. Mm. Either when he went. When he went. Yeah. Um, and then look at uh, England's, they have had some moments. I think Ronaldinho. Do you remember when Ronaldinho chipped? Um, uh, see man, see man, man. Where were you? He's not where you I were. I was in school. I was in my earliest ripping up. I'm were you? Dry. You look trained to me, man. I'm just that tail tennis, but I don't I'm struggling. No, I said, I said about England that um, I, you, I get so nervous in the World Cups when they play. So so nervous, and nervous, I want to get beaten. People are like you're right. a loser because of that, right? And they're like, why would you think like that? But and then I done we meet ball because meet ball was like, why would you care? And I said to meet ball, well, if Arsenal got to the Champions League final, you wouldn't want Arsenal to win it. It's a rivals. Right. Do you know what I mean? So I why know. would why would we support England? It's not it's not been pathetic or it. Of course we don't want England to win. And it's, it's not wheels. It's not no, pathetic, pathetic, but we're not bothered. No, mm. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no. <laughs> but it's actually as much as you, I want England out quickly. <laughs> it makes it too amazing when they keep going because of the feeling you get. You're like, Aye. And then when they get parked out at the last minute, it's even better. <laughs> now, we uh, watched a uh, penalty shoot for the Euros in oh, SWG3, didn't we? Place a rock to so the hand. The boy for Channel 4 was here, remember? And they walked, he left. Oh, he was raging, wasn't he? Just, it was a Rick Edwards. I just showed you that Scotland just... We care, but we don't really care. No, England, listen, England's got a chance. I think every, I think all the top teams <clears throat> with the players in the top leagues have got a chance. Now, what I will say, I know we've got to move on there. Ivan Tony, how he never... How she know where? Would you take him over Kyle Molson? No, I'd take the two of them. Right, so who's the strikers? Kane, Wilson. Kane and Wilson. That's, That's it. it. Rashford's come in. Uh, You'll play Maguire at Melbourne. Who would you have played for? I don't know their full squad, but I think you find a, a way to get them. Right. I, I think they've got Fine. maybe more defenders than, yeah. than they need. I mean, one it's is... Connor Cody there? Yeah. Aye. Aye, so There's one that you'd fucking chop straight away, mate. He's yeah. not playing at all. He goes to every fucking... Get together, I don't think he's having aye, a... But that's that's oh, the thing about the, well. No, aye, he's been brilliant, I know. <laughs> uh -huh. Him and Tarkovsky, I'd, I'd have well, played, you go back I'd three, played that, that three for England. Tarkovsky, Cody and Pickford. Because they're used to playing each other. There's no preparation. They know how to play. Oh, but and been, honestly, they, they, they three have been, they, no, they three have been outstanding. Uh -huh. Really. Um, but anyway, it doesn't matter. They don't want to win, so that's good for me. <laughs> uh, <laughs> but no, Cody's one where... And I think you asked this at the live one about taking players just to be good, good about, about the place. place. He's and one he that you know if you need him, he'll be ready. Mm. But if you don't play him, he's not going to kick off. Yeah. 
and I think you need to have guys that that are ready and that, that know that no no saying oh, I'm lucky to be here, but they understand the role in the squad. Um, I think uh, you you need guys like that as much as guys that are ready to play. Argentina. Argentina, they're winning it, mate. I so. Messi, I'd love it, mate. I'd love to sit. Messi's I'd love to me. watch Ronaldo's face when Messi lifts the world. Do you know they can play each on the final the way it goes? Oh, but honestly, man, I would make that. my year. Messi's, uh, Messi when the world Messi's Cup. playing out his skin and right. PSG. He's back to the old And Messi. Argentina. So you should and I watched that team talk you straight about How good is it? Wow. Good, yeah. I didn't think he Talking about people having kids and he's left his family to be here. I appreciate it so much. We've been away for six weeks together. Not not one player's moaned about one small thing. Imagine And I remember you saying about Roy Keane had the right to leave, but that's not the way Messi acts. Here you go. <laughs> <laughs> so, ah, You're time. on fire. Yeah, You've yeah, dominated him in the table tennis. Took it You've here 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 here. Yeah. Yeah. absolutely yeah. 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 Seriously, you're right to do that. But I'll tell you now, 35 games unbeaten Argentina going to this World Cup. It's going to be socks on camera. Sit back. It's going to change it. No, seriously. Go back. No, seriously. 35 games unbeaten Argentina. They won the Copa America. I hear people saying Brazil, they beat Brazil in the final in the Copa America before you get too excited though. Brazil won the qualifying group though for six points ahead of Argentina five. So who what was the score in the, the Copa America final? Do you know? One nil. Di Maria chipped the goal. So it was a, goal, it was a close game. Wow. Man. But suppose Di Maria could be. You should start doing this with Scottish games. I know. I'm, I should, shouldn't I? <laughs> can I get? Can I get you set up for the domestic level? <laughs> he's all about. He's all about international but wait, football. Di Maria is it? He good could, boy. Di Maria could do it. <laughs> does, he need to, does Messi need to? Um, for me, no. Doesn't need any, it doesn't need to win this no, to no. be the best ever. I don't think. I don't think. It that. doesn't because the, the, the Argentinas in the past that did win World Cups, so like Maradona, who would be deemed one of the greatest players ever, won the World Cup. He had an unbelievable Argentinian team. Did aye. he? Aye, definitely. He's playing against Peter Reid, thought it. I know Peter Reid died. Peter still chasing him. <laughs> Peter Reid. Did Argentina though have a? I don't know if they did. Aye, I, they did. I, I, they did. I think did they? Aye. Maybe later on, but he still carried them. Aye, of course he still they did. carried them. Um, I don't. I, he doesn't need to win it, but if he wins it, then the all the Messi supporters about saying the debate's over. Yeah, yeah. End of debate. He's the best. The World player. Cup was it when Argentina went into one of the World Cups that were, they were quite one of the favourites as well? Was it when they had Raquelme and Simeone? Oh, what, what, what one was that? Because I actually thought that year they that were going to be. That would have been two thousand and two. Would it been no, no, that no. time with their players? Ah, Am I right in saying Messi flopped the last World Cup? Hey. What was the last World Cup? Russia, Russia and France in Russia. In Russia there was one he never had a great tournament was there might have been that one mm-hmm. I think I read something the day that Messi and Ronaldo haven't scored a knockout goal in the World Cup wow wow there's, you know, that's I don't, that know, I don't, know, if, I don't <laughs> know if it's true a knockout goal really <laughs> they've not scored a goal in the knockout stages that's crazy I think isn't it yeah World wow. Cup but, uh, don't quote me on that too late. I'm not even to scoring goals. Of course, it was the man, mate. Of course, it was the man. Is he not the all-time record? Did he not beat the record? He's the all-time record scorer. Did he beat Guillermo? Was it Guillermo? No, Ronaldo said. Ronaldo. Aye, Ronaldo. Who is the World Cup? So, like like that, who is the World Cup icon? Tom Boyd. Tom Boyd's up there for Scotland. Remember, his youth was a legend. Remember, he got. Senegal, he was brilliant. They were brilliant. He beat France. Papi, do you open that? So, France won it. And then the next tournament, first first game they beat them. That was amazing, that. They were absolutely brilliant. The boy that did the the boy that did the dancing for Cameroon, Roger Miller. Go there, go and go. What was the one that keeps doing like that? Do you remember? Do you remember that dance? That was Tom Boyd again. You know who's doing that? Who else was an icon? Big Valderrama for. Columbia uh-huh. uh, USA uh, who's the USA the guy who, who's the like keeper Alexi Lalas. Alexi Lalas these type of guys are I like the World Cup in USA a lot of people USA hate that awesome the, 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 uh, the open remember ceremony that? the Bulgarians no. and the Swedes was it Janet Jackson singing and the goals split in half Diana Ross Diana Ross Close. <laughs> close. <laughs> close. <laughs> it was close. What well, else is an icon? <clears throat> it's a brilliant question now because you get icons and they work like closer. You would he was He was an uh, He was alright, a, a good player, good player, I'm not going to disrespect him, but No, outside the box he was average, wasn't he? Aye, but in the World Cup he's I mean, the top goal scorer ever, isn't he? Great on uh, great way he's head, wasn't he? Oh, he was close, he was, was a good. top player. Was he? Close, uh, Remember by Yanka? Who, who did he go? Who was Carlton his top? Who was his top club? Ah, he went to <laughs> I mean, he played Bayern Munich. Did he play with Munich ahead towards the end to win it? Uh, he went to Lazio, I think. Lazio, that's it. Sorry, Jan kind of had. He was brilliant. He hit the ban against Man United in the Champions League. Do you know, and I'm telling you, on I indiv- just didn't that, right? <laughs> I'd moved on for Jan Do you know the most individual ability I've ever seen for a player? It was England against Argentina. Dan Anderton played for England. I'm not, he's not a player, <laughs> player, he's not a player, but it was that game. It was Hoddle was the manager. Was that 98? No. 2000 and... That was 98. That wouldn't be 98, would it? Uh, it Michael Owen broke out the scene. Ortega. 
was oh, unbelievable. Oh, Ariel Ortega. Ariel Ortega. Aye. Aye. What a football player. Trying to be kind of dark-haired guy. Yeah, yeah. Aye. Pablo Emar as well, remember Did him? Did have Saviola as well? Saviola. Saviola. Tell you what, this is a good memory yeah, thing, isn't it? Yeah. Craig Brown must be a World Cup icon for Wonder how much he's done. Tics, off, off he must have done so <laughs> 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 He's a member of the He's a top scorer for a different reason, Tony. He's a member of the Bear Camp goal. Oh my god. Was that when it came over Argentina? Oh mate. What a goal, man. No, was that on the Euros? No. Nah. That was World Cup. No, I think that was Euros against Argentina. Was it? <laughs> Euros against Argentina. <laughs> what was your favourite Craig Brown goal? <laughs> <laughs> the one in the group was brilliant, wasn't it? <laughs> oh, man. Hey, what, what, no, 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 I don't. I want to say, this is, this is a World Cup icon. <clears throat> no, but a minute, Shai. Si. That is an icon, you're absolutely so we'll go in a minute. Iconic moments in the World Cup. That's happened. Okay, man. Okay. No, uh, <laughs> iconic moments. Uh, Each team will have their own. Beckham's must be up there with the red card. Yep. Remember he was breaking through, uh, beating yeah, everybody, yeah. and then chipping the keeper. Do you know that goal? This is a, a, it's a boring story, but it, after that goal, the morning it's half six in the morning. I was in primary school, and I went into primary school with a softball at half six in the morning, and kept recreating that Michael own goal. Oh, did you, and a teacher said to me, said to my ma, a few years back now, said that they had never seen a kid doing that in their life. Half six in the morning, I went into the playground and kept recreating. Did they not watch it like, the night before? No, nah, we were watching it and they done it. <laughs> no, did they not watch it? <laughs> You're talking about something they've already done it. Eh? <laughs> 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 no, Zidane Peninka. No, Zidane, but then he also <laughs> then he also heat butted uh, Matarazzi. That's, that's, uh, that's the best thing I've ever seen. I love that. He liked the heat butt. Uh, ah, like imagine that mate your nation's on, on your shoulders and you just go fuck this you mind the, it was France 98 as well the Brazil players used to come out holding hands and, and that's flipped. right that so was in that documentary so powerful did Roberto do the baby aye, celebration 94. Aye. Uh -huh. 94 we had a wee discussion earlier me and you on the Zoom call didn't we the two about the blonde hair with Romania I didn't, I didn't stand aye. for that the blonde hair with what? Romania you'd have been first in aye. you'd have well done that but now if Mary's a coach I wouldn't accept players <laughs> doing it no why? Ban Patrescu, you know that, wasn't it? Ban? Ban who? Ban Babicki! Hadji! Ban Patrescu, you know that? Hadji was World Cup 94. Oh, that was some World Cup. was the Bulgarian Stoichkov. Stoichkov, oh! Stoichkov and... What a player? Stoichkov, was it? Aye, and fuck off, he was some player. Come back. That was your name, was it not? Right, we're moving on to an absolute... World Cup icons. Oh, a real right. icon, Jason oh. Cummings, going unbelievable. Oh, well done, we, man. Well I remember when we were talking about the last Hydro show, when I remember we left that night and the next morning we were up, we had done a podcast night and we all went, what? He's fucked. Uh, he'll be like, because he was dressed uh, as a joker, went into mate Jazza, sitting there with a joker makeup kid, on he was the, at the show <laughs> with a joker makeup one, and we were thinking, you, feel, you kind of felt bad a wee bit, thinking, no. never felt a bad no, yeah, money went in the bank, money in the bank. We used, an, we, we, we used and abused him. <laughs> To be fair, that's not true. He, we, no, no, he wanted to do it. He, he wanted to do it. But what's ended up happening is amazing for because him. of that fallout with Jasper, he had to look at what's his name, Jazza. <laughs> Jasper. <laughs> <laughs> sorry, sorry, James. Sorry, James. That's for the ghost. That's what who? The ghost. Jasper. 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 What is going on now? Come on, come on. Enjoy his guy, buddy. He's spelled it with Jasper. Oh, ja Jasper was, was close. Jasper, Car <laughs> Jasper the ghost. Golden Bowl, so I show him. I show him. Stick of steel. I show him. Jasper, man, that is genius. <laughs> so, <laughs> Jasper, so we had him up there. Jasper's the male. Can't wait, Jasper the ghost. And they decided oh. to oh. F off to Australia, <laughs> and it's one so of the So, do you think Jasper will be watching it? Oh, I hope so. He'll be so, over raging. Oh, oh, so. <laughs> Sorry, Jazza. <laughs> no, but I, 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 honestly, what a boy you need. The best thing is, mate, he'll not play a second. Eh? No, <laughs> I'll play a second. He knows that. <laughs> I don't know about that. He knows that. Is he one of the new the strikers? The, that's the light in the striker era. Mm -hmm. Aye. And and I think the, did you see the video? The the manager was like phoning him. These lights, so they filmed it, aye. Gone, gives a grease lightning. <laughs> he just belted it grease lightning. <laughs> to the manager, he's like, hey, that's enough. That's enough. <laughs> Don't need to go any further. So he's not just there for the dressing room, now, he's there on. No, I, I think, think he's got a chance. He's, I think he's done well. I think he's got a chance. They Amazing, isn't it? You can't even meet, like, mean, but what a boy he was. How does he qualify for Australia? That's what I want to know. Parents, I think. Is his parents? I think his mum's Australian. Oh, Did you ever have a chance? I'm not, they play in the Ireland nation. Nah, I, when I was younger, the Northern uh, Republic of Ireland scouted asked if I'd done the Irish in me, but I didn't have any in me. <laughs> so no, no, so, no. Nah. <laughs> but, so what, a Republic of Ireland scout just came up to you? I just said if you get any Irish uh, grandparents or whatever. What, in, 
Well, I'm praying for uh, someone under 17s at the training ground. Eh? And I said, I'll have a look. Because <laughs> I hadn't been cut by anybody. <laughs> I think you had Jasper at my head. Was <laughs> no, no, I've got anybody Irish. I went, nah. And uh, <laughs> that was it. <laughs> Jasper the coast. That is genius. That saved me. <laughs> <laughs> and, uh, what is, and, uh, what, something that I always love and it gets your blood boiling, you know, that, and, and everything's stunning up is the World <laughs> Cup songs. What's your favourite World Cup song in the years? Got to be John Barnes, isn't it? Oh, fuck it. Oh, you've got the whole. Mate, do you know what's amazing? Brazil's national anthem. Go gaze it. No, I don't know what I buy, but see when they all sing it with passion, it's amazing that. Well, we're not going to get the Italians, are we? This one singing the anthem, that used to be a. Did the Pavarotti not sing it with the Italian one? Italian 91. That's the name. No, no, you keep going. Wait, Kev, leave him, leave him, leave him. He's like the cartoons, he was the watch, but. That's the best. That's the best, mate. That was. Yeah. Here's on the back of your arse standing up. <laughs> That's the best. That was good. So who, who, we're going to see them singing. Go on, Pavarotti, geezer. No. <clears throat> You're the man, come on. What was singing? Ness and Dorma. You like a big opera singer? Uh, come with on. With a long, <laughs> <see the> long <laughs> tail coat. <laughs> go on, Jasper, geezer. <laughs> Why is it so high? <laughs> I'm just getting his voice. <laughs> I've just had an operation on my neck. What do you want me to do? <laughs> <laughs> Nearly took my voice box out. I just got to be. Wait a minute. <laughs> 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 What's another national anthem? Scotland went to World Cup night. Had a wee song. France. To be able to find that. Something like "Don't Come Home Too Soon." Oh, ah, so oh, fucking negative. Oh, oh, that was. <laughs> that was. That was. I have a dream. I had a dream. That was brilliant. Right. What is that? Andy Cameron. Andy Cameron. I. What did that go like? Is it? No. Caledonia is brilliant. Yeah. What Is about, um, you like the, the Basil and Skinner, so Frank Skinner, uh, Frank Skinner, what was that show called? Sorry. Basil, Frank Skinner. Was that, what was that the deal, show they done? The Deal and Sarsler. Basil and Jasper. Basil and Jasper. Yeah, so Basil and Jasper. Basil and Jasper. Basil <laughs> this is good to see what, all the preview world cup shows here in the world this has got to be the worst I don't know how serious that show's been amazing isn't it that show's been amazing right really here we good. go Ma the, 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 the best nation I think in the world cup that likes the world cup Basel <laughs> does that mean Brazil <laughs> oh that's what you were reading that, you were reading that, that wasn't that you Basel Brazil, Brazil. And you, were, you were outstanding thanks it during the week with this O'Hara because O'Hara's lab is not going to easy and you actually were midfield geezer midfielders and you look at the man United midfield you look at the squad it is not Gimmerish. Gimmerish. Uh, Newcastle and New Man United oh, midfielder. Have you seen them, mate? They've, they've called up Danny Alves, who's 39, and plays in Mexico. Huh? And uh, left Bobby with Firmino it. Uh, you're not putting Firmino if you on goals, are you? No, I've got enough creative Firmino, players. I would have taken Firmino. Instead of Danny Alves, I know he's not playing right back for me. But, <laughs> <laughs> but I don't, I don't think the, I don't think the squad who's is going good. Go, who's scoring all the goals? Allison. Richarlison Again, it's Richarlison Martin Wait, Ellie. he's the one that's going the goals with them Wait, they're not Jesus. winning Martin Ellie, uh, Jesus Jesus Martin Ellie Jesus Martin Ellie Jesus 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 Who's a, who is a midfield game, Irish? Casemiro and Fred. Casemiro, Anthony. What? Uh, that's what I'm saying, Man United's midfield, mate. <laughs> and people are like, saying Brazil are the favourites. Like, Fred, 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 Casemiro, Anthony. Um, I've actually got the team layout. Just if I flick that up, have a look at the face ID. Oh, it doesn't even recognise me. <laughs> uh, we've got it here. You've got your phone, Jasper. <laughs> Didn't you apologise to him? So, is, are they your favourites? Uh, no, I, I'm going for Argentina. Mm. But... I think that Brazil are. You can't write them off, can you? Um, he's good, that manager. T -t is this Neymar's time? You see where Messi and Ronaldo come to the end? Is this Aye, Aye, Neymar's right. time to go and be the main man at a World tell Cup? Me, Aye, tell Aye. me you saw the Neymar video with the touch from 120 feet at the sky. The no. video, did you see it? No. Wow. The day in Brazil, they're always having a get together, and somebody's put a thing up, wheel, like miles up, and they brought it down. And he only just controlled it, he's kept it up like this high off the ground. Incredible bit. Remember, we done that off the bus at SWG3 and Gary Hope can they control it for five yards? <laughs> they were not. We tried to drive the bus at the same time. But no, I think Neymar could be a standout as well. But like, Remember the last World Cup with him? Remember, they get injured and, and all the players come out holding his tap? No, pathetic. Rubbish, mm. I don't know. Like what were we thinking of the three? Did you see the, the three tackle? from, the the three from PSG? Boy, absolutely tonight. Neymar for Brazil, Mbappe for France, Messi for Argentina. Who's going to be the star of the three? Messi. 
Definitely. I think so. I think top so. scorers, Benzema all day. Benzema top scorer. France, on paper, France have got by far who the best Who else in all top scorer potentially? Do you know yeah. top scorer? Do you know who else plays? Harry Kane. Okay, okay. Aye, no, because there's, no, there's, no, there's no any world injured. Kinkou, is it? I know he's injured. You know, they just start to not read up on the few man there. Is he injured? Do you know what he's going to do? That's massive, because imagine him behind Mbappe and... Your dad's not paid the sky bill again. <laughs> the coins in the hang. I think he could have been a star for the World Cup. Who? Uh-huh. In Kunku. He's yeah, doing great. Yeah. Oh, it's a big loss in Canty's out and all. Pogba. Pogba. Pogba as well. Who goes in the midfield of France? <laughs> I don't know. I haven't got a clue. Deschamps. <laughs> I don't, know who plays. I don't know who plays there Belgium no chance No chance Done They had their chance Last World Cup finish uh, That was their chance Last World Cup wasn't it I don't know You still don't think know. Don't know The best players are Still got company Play at the back isn't there Company All the Vero Hazards I mean, he, I mean it was the last time He played in my family I think they've got uh, You would think that Their better chance Was the last one Yeah With the players in the yeah. prime But You just you just never know De Bruyne The level he's playing at Is ridiculous He's the best Aye uh, So you, you know that He can create mm. Lukaku's not had a great but you know he can score goals <clears throat> but he scores goals for Belgium mm-hmm. and he doesn't yes. actually get involved in any of the play he just plays as a number nine they create chances and he scores goals doesn't even touch a ball half the time yeah we're <clears throat> so talking about know. obviously like the, 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 the fancy teams is there a team that could come out of nowhere in, like in past history shows like so South Korea who did it in 2002 got to semi-final we had yeah. Senegal that got to I think Senegal this year again I think so as well. I think Manny's fit. Manny's fit. He's the first two weeks. He's yeah. the first two games, aye. So they could be it. They, they won the, the Afri- AFCON, aye. didn't yeah, they? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Beat Egypt. Egypt. Could it be the first time the an African nation wins it? I don't I, think, I, I don't know when. No, I think with the conditions. Yeah. It's 30 odd degrees. Is it still in the winter? Aye. It's, it might, it might suit them. I know that, you know, a lot of the players play in Europe and they'll be used to it, but you go to the AFCON last year and the conditions they need to play on, the pitches they play on and they go on they go and do well, so I think it might be saying that they, they, there's always a, a year where the, there's an African team mm. that does well. I think Ghana done well. Ivory Coast yeah. always had a team, didn't they? Ivory right. Coast, Ivory Coast, Coast drug drug yeah. Cameroon, yeah, 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 yeah. Did you see the, you see the Cameroon yeah, manager? Uh, yeah. No, he was with Ghana. Oh, was he did you see the Cameroon manager naming the squad? No. I've got the names, the players' names, right? <laughs> Jasper. <laughs> oh, it was stinging me. It was an old man, Rigabell song. Aye, he's got the players' names. He's like, Aston, Rigabell. The assistant's telling him, he's gone, no, no, it's this. <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, they're saying that Eto, he's the president of the Football Association Is he? And they're saying that he's picking, he's <laughs> picking the players. The so he's like, they're at last. <laughs> like, when we matter them up here and they go, right, this is what we're doing. Mate, do you know who's got some squad? Wow, sorry. Who's got some squad? Uruguay. Nunes or not? And um, Nunez Suarez is still playing Valverde for Real. Aye. What a player he is. Amazing. So they could be a dark horses? I think they could be a dark horses, Uruguay. I'd love them. I love them. Uruguay, they, they, they don't win the World Cup. They're animals, aren't they? They won the World Cup. Remember the them against... Yeah, oh, no, the first one. Or was it the first, uh, it one? first one? first one. Remember the one against... And somebody yeah, won the Was it Suarez? Suarez saved it. And, 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 and then after that? And then the boy that played with Sunderland. That's a Samoa Jan. He missed the penalty. That's a Samoa Jan. Azerbaijan. Azerbaijan. Say that's a Samoa Jan. Check out, mate. Azerbaijan. Azerbaijan. <laughs> it was close. <laughs> it was in talky teeth. Right, boys. 13 SPFL players heading the World Cup. Brilliant. It's a good number, isn't it? Really good. So we've got Aaron Moy, Cameron Carter, Vickers, mm. Dyson Mida, Josip Juranovic. Who's that? How'd you say that? I think BH. BH. Dylan Levitt, Nathaniel Atkinson, Cammy Devlin, Kyle Rolls. Who's. It's Kyle Rolls. Se- who's. Um, it's Kyle Rolls. Steady no <laughs> Australia's backline. Martin Boyle yeah, and Borna yeah. Barisic. What is it? He's a belter, are they, didn't he? With Kai Rose, that Kai was Rose. genius. You were like, bro, he's made, made hearts much better since he's came back in. Give Sorry, a penalty. Right. Just gave me a penalty, <laughs> sort of. Sent after him, gave a penalty. But he has made them a bit right. stronger. Who yeah. else? Who, who at that, um, <laughs> that list, Jen, could go over and do well? I think Carter, Carter because, because I think he'll be massive for the yeah. USA. Uh, Juranovic for Croatia? Aye. I think Juranovic will be hell-bent on having a good one because I think he's um, refused a new deal to sign a new deal at Celtic, so potentially looking for a good World Cup for a good move. 28 years old. And I think mm. Boyle, I think Boyle for Australia will be massive Boyle. for them. Boyle for me. Yeah. You think you could do something, huh? Aye, uh, pace, yeah, direct. Yeah, yeah. Surely Paris is And that's going to have to be a team, Australia, where it's a, a hard team to play against. Try and, you know, cause, I think he's got the, the ability to cause teams problems. And I, I hope they do it. I think, I hope Australia do well because it reflects well on their yeah, league. Yeah. When you look at the, the players that are there, Cammy Devlin, I think he's been sensational for Hearts. I'm a big fan of Cammy Devlin because just his tenacity, he just, just gets stuck in. 
stands up to the big players. Mm -hmm. Probably could score more goals, but I'm sure that will come. But hopefully Australia will and do well. Brilliant, lads. Very this good. has been an absolute shambles, but I've enjoyed it. <laughs> uh, predictions. Who will win it? Argentina for me. I'll go Argentina. Germany, I, I've said it because of Hansi Flick, I can't go, but I, their squad's not great, but I'll go in Germany. No, you're not you've not mentioned it the whole... The whole Do you know this as well? I've done it last night, you know, I've, I don't know what I thought about Germany. I, their the, the squad, they, they lack a wee bit in their squad, but I think Hansi Flick's the best manager there, so I'll stick by you, Hansi Flick. Best manager there? I think so, mate. Hansi Hansi best manager there? <clears throat> Deschamps has won... Uh, I've not mentioned Spain either. Spain's squad terrible by the way. Is it? Um, that is up front. Right? It, but their, te their team is poor up front. Let me know. I think the best player like Ferran Torres. He was a man say. Dog shit. Well, was he talked about you as a guy? Pedri, Gavi, and. Centre mids, but you're. you're, you're, you're I mean, even defence. I mean, the goal is Unai Simon. I left the game. The Hayes left, do I? There's two, two Premier League goalies gone. Have mm. you mm. spent? Brentford mm. goal there, something? Is it? Rhea. Right. I don't know. I'm going to say. I don't expect to get a hope now. Who are you going, Kev? I would like. I'd like to see Messi lift the World Cup. I think that would be the fairy tale. I think they've got a good squad. Is this, by the way, who we want to win it? Or who do you think we'll win? I think. I think. I think I'm going to Argentina as well. Do you know what's been under the radar? Van Gaal's Dutch. Yeah. Um, mm. oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I think they could be good. He's been great with him. They were so cool. Or right. is that your winners? Can Good you call them a dark it. horse? No, nah, I think you could. Watch no Bar Van Dijk is the best big names. You would go. I know. Spain, Holland, Germany. They're dark horses. They're, they're normally right up there. Yeah. To, to win it. Nah, I agree. You would, you would go with them as being dark horses. Because Holland didn't they? They didn't qualify for the Euros. The Euros. Mm -hmm. So they've obviously had you a big. Dutch there, didn't you? Yeah. They've had a big overhaul, and I think they've got some decent players now. But dark horses, possibly. What would the, you, you obviously know the place, what would it be like over there? Wild, oh, wild. wild. Absolutely wild. I don't know how they're going to contain them earlier. <laughs> they'll hate them earlier, the uh -huh. Qataris. But no, listen, I think they've got a chance under Van Gaal. If, they get, if Holland mm. get to final, will you go back? I'll do it for the Dutch. <laughs> I'll do it just for them. Dark horses in, who would say? To win it, I'll or go just to have a good tournament. Uruguay. Good tournament. Uruguay, that's a great dark horse. Aye. I'll go Croatia again. Aye, that's a good shout. Who plays up front for them? You see, goal you see the goal scorer in the You see the goal scorer. You need a goal scorer in this tournament. Who plays up front for Croatia? Can't I go to Devel? Perisic. He's left wire. Who's up front? Side. <laughs> False nine. Perisic. Why is it? He talks about who's up front for Croatia? Who is it? Not a clue. Who is up front for? <laughs> right, Kev. Um, hey, Dark Horse, I'll go for Belgium. <clears throat> No, nah, they're done. Oh yeah, Belgium, man. Yeah. They're done, Kevin. Just, change, it, change it, change it, they're done. Dark horse. Just, I'm going to go with the fact that De Bruyne is in the form of his life. Right, okay. Um, I'm going Senegal, by the way. Senegal? Senegal okay. Play the tournament. Who did you say? Croatia. Play the tournament. I'm going to go Messi. Aye. Messi for me. Neymar. Neymar. Mm -hmm. Perisic. I'm going to go Jude Bellingham. Mm. Ooh. So you're not having them to win it or Dark Horse, but I you're going to pick one of players. Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> Just fucking say that. Well, see, so be <laughs> see me belly and will you ask, see what Jake's <laughs> if you could let him go, Jake, you'll have him erase his sitting. Plays with that set or two setters, doesn't he? But Depends how they line up. If they go a 3-4-3 three, three to get the solid at the back, we'll go three at the back two, yeah, yeah. and the sitters, he'll not have the freedom to go. Although I would, they two could play old school. Yeah. Would you yeah. watch your mids. One he's set, one, set one he's go. Was he playing in the night you went to Dortmund? Aye. Was it, did he go? Did aye, he go on one? Aye. Did he? Aye, he was mere advanced, aye. Was he? Aye. He's got great feet in about the box now, isn't he, as well? Just got everything. He's, aye, he's, he's a top player. Golden boot. Benzema. <laughs> but, uh, I just keep picking Messi for everything. Then I'm just uh, desperate for Messi. I'm going to go Messi as well. Golden boot. I might go Mbappe, actually. Oh, I was going to say him. I'm thinking Portugal, for some reason I think I see them getting loads of stupid penalties and Ronaldo just taking penalties. <laughs> Aye. Do you know what I mean? Kane, what about Kane? Kane will score goals, but Aye. you've got to look at the group situation. Who's got the the easier of the groups? So you're looking at Aye. England, Wales, England, USA, Iran and USA. There's a potential there I think there Japan for... and USA might be good, aren't they? I, know, I, think, I think Japan will be decent. They're Iran. in Spain and Germany. I think Iran's Japan. Too. <laughs> What's going on here, honestly? Japan's in Germany, Spain's group. Japan will be good. 
<laughs> I think Japan will be decent. You've got them in two groups. <laughs> Japan need to play three <laughs> Japan games. Japan Japan see, <laughs> so whoever's up front for Japan will play because he's got more no games than everybody else. Yeah. So Maida might be top scorer because he's got six group games. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> instead of three. Uh, biggest letdown. Mm. Brazil, I'm going to go. Here you go. Are you? Portugal. That's a great shout, Portugal. Portugal. I um, can see that flopping. France. <laughs> France for uh, it's no flop. Yeah, it will oh, be no, France for Mbappe to be top scorer. <laughs> <laughs> I'll take the first game, but scores. Oh, the, the, we're going to need to do the show over again. France are supposedly at what the players are going to worry each other already. Why? Because remember the last time they all met up, Mbappe Aye. didn't he refuse to win the World Cup, the team photo. He was had uh, an argument about Amy's rights. Amy's rights and refused Aye, to win. Can you can you win a tournament with a guy like that in your squad? I don't think. Remember the last time uh, Mbappe's dad was fighting with Pog, uh, another Rabio. Rabio's da or ma? They were fighting Rabio's ma. Ah, had a go at Mbappe's da. Ah, no way. Aye. Says he should be taking any chances or something. When no, he had a, time to get put in out the early. In the stands. Well, well, arguing with a France top zone. And wanted to leave, he didn't want to be there. So, so you need to be careful with him. France, I think you could be right, France biggest that letdown. Happens every, that happens so many times. I know they won it. The last World Cup won it for Croatia, but see before that, remember the one we, we Dominic was the manager? <laughs> That's right, they all went yeah, against him. And Sky were on the training ground. It's amazing how the World Cup internationally that players used to just love going because it was a representing a country whereas now it feels like we're going as individuals for their image, for their image uh-huh. and for, for them and, and that, that, that kind of puts the damper on things Mbappé's won the World Cup already he's 23 yeah 23. Aye. it was unreal all the, all the players have won it so if there's any kind of unrest Mbappé obviously wants to be the star at PSG he wants to be the star at France you hate because Benzema came back was why he'd done all that because Benzema came back that Euros and he played up how many's da they two played up because Benzema was back and he doesn't like it because he's Benzema not was brilliant for him because right. he led the line and held it up think he's one that hates that Benzema got the ballon though aye and he hated the, the fact that Messi got the big deal and that's when he came out and started blabbing a lot of rubbish because Messi got the big deal at PSG that's when he played up to all that nonsense did you see the thing uh, he wanted to leave PSG because he didn't pay him his wages 5 million for a month Five million. <laughs> five million for a month. <laughs> He's reached his on the end of the pipe. You're slagging him. <laughs> five, five million a month. <laughs> five million a month. Five million a month. Five million a month. You got an increase. <laughs> <laughs> I was going to ask you, this is such a stupid question because it's an actually going to do 25 after that short Monday. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just doing it because of my health. I've just came off He's, for he's paying the producer to get on now. <laughs> no, listen, see, um, because you, to play for your country's an honour. Does any international team of players get paid to go over your country? No. I think you do know, didn't you? No. Way. How did we get paid? Was it was it all the sponsorship and it, when it got to the end of the? But what do you get paid when? Wait, 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 so wait. at the end of the international season, I think there's a lot of like sponsorship and Aye. things you do through Sponsor. like yeah whatever, and then at the end of the the season, there's a pot of money, and then it's like a pro rata type thing, isn't Aye. it? You used to get a match fee. Did you? Like Aye. How much so you was get, it? I'm going to say I think it was about sixteen hundred quid. Did you not say that Bertie used to come to your room with 50 in between his arms? <laughs> he said the pot in. Do you know what I genuinely love about it? We scrapped the match. Do you know what I used to genuinely love about the international? Do you wonder? He no, did scrap them because I'm thinking yeah. 1600. I never got uh, 1600. I think it was, you got, you got a match fee and Bertie came in and says, look, at Germany they just, they, they put it on bonuses. So, so they don't get a reward for playing at each individual game. The reward is you play for your country. So why don't we make it, you get a big bonus if you qualify for a tournament and we're like, ah, yeah, that's great. <laughs> didn't qualify saved the SFA a fortune <laughs> who negotiated that deal well we, we all thought we were going to get there didn't we I would have died you'll be phoning the SFA the day won't you I'm going to phone them you say that I'm going to do that back before uh, <laughs> the, <laughs> the mobiles and that you used to get a wee phone card mine what did get your phone card like a uh, number you, you never got that either he's ready that's what it's for I like to I like to I used to like them yeah, mobile yeah, yeah, yeah. he was on the chart he was on the chart he used to get the 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 he used to they don't know what they're talking about because they've never been there right speed me man didn't you not a ball you battered Spain didn't you we Scotland got beat I just don't want to speak I was going to ask if he's your is your dad waiting is he done it now or is he waiting for the two before he gets his Brazil you done <laughs> terrible wasn't it <laughs> terrible end this now oh, end this wait a minute no, I'm going to change my golden boot I can't have Mbappe I'm not changing I'm, I'm going to go <laughs> I'm going to go Messi why not right to end the show for everybody your favourite ever World Cup goal oh, to Dan's oh, Perenka wow. oh, to Dan's Dink it's too many was it a World Cup that Pirlo put Joe Hart on his ass as well uh, no Euros is that the Euros I would probably say Ronaldo's toe poke 
because having watched the documentary last night and understanding why he did it, I it's thought the only one you remember. No, I remember loads. <laughs> <laughs> I remember loads. Remember Mike Conch for the byline? Aye. I remember that. David Platt's volley against Belgium when it so came over his head. That was incredible. Over his egg head. Yeah, the best Lee World Cup calls against Platt. Sweden. Has to be Arge uh, Maradona's against England. England, the hair. Oh. No, the hand of God. That was good, but the that was genius. The dribble. Yeah, That's yeah, got yeah. to be the boy. Boydies. It's got to be boydies, isn't it? Boydies. Try your time, boy. Try to clean it off the line. Scored their own G in the World Cup against Brazil. And they slaughtered half of us. He's a hero, boydies. He knows what I'm talking about. Yours, Paul. My favourite goal? Yep. If I was my clone. And my mic so you say so you, in one part of the show you said you hate England, then the next part you're <laughs> practicing England goals in the playground. So no. what is it? No, listen, that goal was exceptional. Right? When when you're young and you're looking at a young guy, eighteen year old today, that was outrageous. But what goal do you like better? That goal or the one he scored against the wee stock keeper for Neville Silver? <laughs> <laughs> Brilliant. Brilliant. I'm very Michael. good, Michael. He's 13. Don't get me out there, man. This is his last like, manager. I'm going to get a text from him saying that's him done here, mate. I can, I'm feeling it. This will be his last one. We need to take him out and speak to him. Favourite manager ever at the World Cup? Oh, my God. <laughs> Craig Brown, that. He's got the top, the top scorer. There's some crazy managers, but. Best manager at a World Cup. Like, oh, I can't, can't believe I've not no, said that. Uh, Archie Gemmell's best, best World Cup. Remember that goal? Uh, no. Nah, Archie Gemmell, best, best World Cup goal ever scored. What was the World Cup Friday where Scotland had that free kick in the, the, the African team? Zaire. 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 Yeah, 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 genius. Yeah, they, they, wouldn't, they wouldn't have let Scotland take the free kick. Every time they kept running, the running at the free kick. What? So Scotland had a free <laughs> kick on the edge of the box. <laughs> and they just wouldn't let Scotland take it. Every time the ref blew, they, just run they ran towards the ball. The ball. Yeah. The ball. So, it was for about 10 minutes. <laughs> the, boy, the boy ran and volleyed it away for the pass. <laughs> He's just done that. Google it. It's, it's actually amazing. It's amazing. It's amazing. Uh, uh, Lappy. Did he win it? No, but I mean, no uh, Del Bosque, they played the best football, mate. That's the best football I've seen. Big Scalari. Spain's football, that world cup. Big Phil Scalari. Big Phil's a man as well. He's but Ronaldo's haircut. <laughs> That's it, my definition of a team that's been. There must have been World something. Spain team are not getting into controversies. Mm. Is that is. That, aren't we? I'm not, I don't think Spain won two penalty shoot. Mate, the teams couldn't get a kick of the ball. Well, check it up, we'll check it up. We'll check it out. I need to check it out. Should we get a new actually, yeah. Because I'm going to ask that just the last one. Contra what's the biggest controversial moment in the World Cup? Was for a few contra. Roy Keane. I, I, no, Roy I Keane say, nah. That was a disgrace. Roy Keane leaving. And I know you said it was good for Roy Keane standing up to things, and I get that. You don't do it in that way, Sai. You don't. Oh, I spoke Mick about that. <gasps> I did die. This is what happened, and he just, I think it was something to do with. Big Rick. Back in when Roy was younger, I think, come onto the bus. Ah, that's right, it's in his book. Ah, You've read, read, oh, no, read that in his book. He's read that in his book. What did he say? Was it, didn't, did they two have it out? And then he went, I've had enough. That's it, just left, but. You couldn't leave a World Cup. That takes big balls, that, didn't it? Is it? To leave is a it, squad. It, it's bad, that, though. Why would you not want to miss the World, World Cup? Cup? Ronaldo 98 must be the biggest controversy. Remember that? Like, the chefs? Aye. The chefs, yeah. Well, uh, well, chefs. <laughs> Mate, that was like... I, I, I was heartbroken that yeah. he was... That was great. Roberto Carlos says he, 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 he lay there in the bathroom three minutes seizure shaking for three minutes he <laughs> wasn't playing, man, you know. <laughs> <But I can't. clears throat> if he was 100% he'd have won it. Do you think? Oh. He, he, says, he, he says himself that even if he was 100%, he still felt that France were better than Dan and was just incredible that time. I bet. I, I, I get that, but Ronaldo, his best, just oh. gave him the ball. He was a joke. When was it his best, 98 or 2002? 98. 98. Think so? 98, 98 up to the final. 2002 was a joke, then. <clears throat> 2002 was a joke. Do you think, see, back then, I know you've got Messi and Ronaldo who, in this era, who are probably the best players <clears throat> ever or whatever you want to say, the numbers they've done. But you, I think overall you had better players back then. I agree. I'd agree. Like, technically, I agree. Team, players, yeah. Yeah. in a aye, general sense, you talk <laughs> about, you, you would have a favourite, you wouldn't, it's not out of two players. Like, I yeah. love Zidane, I thought Zidane, Zidane was off. outstanding. But yeah. Every nation had these, but I don't feel <clears> now that <throat> you, you watch a game of football and go, I can't wait to watch him play. Him play uh, I don't speak through that now. Maybe a couple of players, but... Haaland's like, a big very mess, tactical now football. Uh, very tactical. Sometimes, the, sometimes now in the modern day, the, the, the best players don't actually get to play in the World Cup because, like, they maybe having to qualify. You think of Haaland? Yeah. Will Norway ever qualify for a World Cup? Like, Gar Gareth Bale's this his first World Cup. Bale's first. No, it's Bale's his first. First There's World no Cup. So, like, Giggs never got there. You think of players like that? Slatan, he's been millions. Aye, he's been. Did Tommy J ever play a World Cup? Do you know that? Aye, he would have. He would have. Aye. They, by they've the way, got a they chance. Could be, they could be they've that. I can't believe we've never spoke about it because the last time Chris and Ericsson played in the Euros, the last time Chris and Ericsson played in a major tournament, it was 
they so died on nice. the pitch. So big, big emotional return to the big they've stage, been, and he's been excellent for for Man United. Aye, yeah, in Brazil good. for having to play Man United yep. midfielders. How I mean, I don't know how we've got to this stage. Yeah. Where you going, Brazil? Midfield Man United is rubbish. Uh-huh. But Ericsson's been, uh, been top draw. Yeah. So hopefully they go and do well. Best you World Cup player you've played with? I've played at the World Cup last one. Seriously. Played with? And so you've played with a player that's played at the World I've Cup? Played, I've played with a World Cup winner. Yeah. That's the question you should be doing. Guess. It's a top You'll never three. get it. I said you'll never No, wait, I'll get it. It's obviously Everton. It. Aye, but you'll never get it. No, wait, I'll get this. World Cup How winner. long have we got? The battery's running. So, out. wait, when you were at Everton, what, do you tell us the countries that won it while you were there? Brazil. Yeah, I'll tell you the country I played for right, if you want. Germany. You're See never that. getting it. It's a, f- it's a fullback. That is, I know who it is. It's a fullback, isn't it? It's a defender. I played fullback, it's a defender. It's a defender, I know. Oh, <laughs> black hair. No. Dark hair. Uh huh. Oh. Remember we worked under Bono when he won the World Cup and he said the, 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 the SFA are telling me what to do. He came to my house. No. I showed him no, the World Cup when he was meddling. No, he was fat. Italian. Keep going. Italian? He was, uh, it starts with an F. Italian. But it's like a German. Thriller. Thriller. Ricardo. No, I don't. No, I played. That's like Friedrich or something. No, it's no. I played no. my World Cup finalist, Edson Braffy. Does it sound German? Eh? Who is it? Just tell us, because he's not Mustafi. Nah, we never got it. Mustafi. Aye. Played, it was at Everton. <laughs> it was Everton when I went back. Was it? Well, won the World Cup. Wow. So he was. But he's not. He's not the best player I've played with. That's played at World Cup. No. Who's the best you played with? That's played at a World Cup. Oh, Rooney. Rooney. It's a terrible <clears throat> question. No, but I mean, if you played with any? <laughs> I think I did. <laughs> I think I did. Tom, Thomas Helmer played with Germany. Played Hi. Braffy, remember? Thomas Braffy. Braffy. Played with Reina. Well, yeah, come yeah, he was good. Uh, Reina would have. Reina. Reina definitely would have. boy will be Stephen there. Stephen Schwartz. Well. Sweden. Yeah. He played for Arsenal, didn't he? Yep. Boy, it's been an honour. Huh? It's been very good. Stephen Schwartz. Your hero. When he was at the World Cup, fucking uh-huh. sure he was. <laughs> Your hero, Can't man. Believe Jason Matatier. Jason Matatier. Remember uh, Van Persie, Jasper Diamond Heater. Jasper Matatier. Remember? Jasper Matatier. Van Persie, Diamond Heater. Oh, that was a belter. Play the whole game of shambles for this. Play the whole game of shambles. Boys, well done. Well done. Well done. Well done. Well done.